Hello, I'm Mary Roberts. Today we're at Great Plains Health in North Platte, Nebraska. At Great Plains Health, there are 1,200 employees, 90 physicians, and more than 30 medical specialties. To work in healthcare, you need to have a passion for serving your community and making an impact on your patients. So let's get started on our healthcare careers tour. And as we get started at Great Plains Health, we're joined by Danny Franzen, Chief Operating Officer. Danny, can you tell us a little bit about Great Plains Health? Great Plains Health is a local hospital. It's independent hospital, and we have lots of services here for our patients. We have a very recognized cancer center. We have heart casts, so we've reduced our mortality in our patients for those. We've got sports and therapy and a large rehab center for all of our athletes in the area as well. And we serve an area that's bigger than Pennsylvania, so it's quite an area that this hospital serves. When you think of a hospital, you might first think of the labor and delivery floor, and newborn babies, or you might think of the emergency room, but there really is so much more to it than that. There is a lot more at Great Plains Health. We have a lot of services for a hospital that our size. And Danny, you have really built your career here at Great Plains Health, and you started in the lab. Can I you tell us start. about that? Mm -hmm. I started with my local community college at Mid Plains, and I graduated with an associate's degree out there, and I grew up in the lab. And after that, I went on to get my bachelor's degree in clinical laboratory science, and that allowed me to be a laboratory manager. And so I was a laboratory manager for several years, and then I went on to be a senior director of ancillary services, and that's all of those clinical areas that are not nursing. And I did that for a while while I I was obtaining my master's degree, moved into some physician services side, and now chief operating officer. It's been a great career here at Great Plains Health. That sounds pretty awesome, Danny. There is one career that I'd like to dig deeper into though. Who should I talk to? You need to go talk to Jamie. She's a great person to talk to. That sounds awesome. I'm really excited to learn more about healthcare careers and in particular, being an RN. Danny Franzen, our Chief Operating Officer at Great Plains Health, said I should speak to you, Jamie, about the careers that are available in healthcare, specifically RNs. So can you tell me what does RN stand for and what do you do back here? Okay, so I am an RN or a registered nurse. Um, I have my bachelor's degree. I actually was able to get it through the hospital here. Here in Same Day Services, we um, pre-op patients, we get them ready for surgery, we recover them, and then hopefully we either send them home um, to recover on their own or upstairs. I am also a charge nurse in Same Day Services, so I'm kind of the liaison between the staff and either the physicians or surgeons themselves or the anesthesia providers. Kind of make those phone calls if they need, um, help with difficult IVs, things like that. So as an RN in Same Day Services, you are really with that patient from the very start of their procedure all the way through. You kind of have to be a people person for this, right? Absolutely, very much you have to be a people person because you're dealing with people all day long. Um, but I am a very, very much a people person. Um, I love that interaction. I love the teaching portion of it. I like to be that comforting face and um, expertise and knowledge that the patients need when they come here. So what made you decide that you wanted to look into a career in nursing? Well, like I said, I've always kind of been a people person. I like helping people. So I think it was just kind of natural. I wanted to do it. Um, I've been a nurse for 18 years. I've done several different things in nursing. There's so many different avenues that you can go. I have um, worked for the American Red Cross. I've worked in labor and delivery here in the hospital. I've been an occupational health nurse. I've worked in the cardiac cath lab, and now I'm here in same day services as a charge nurse. So there's always a route and an avenue that you can take always something exciting. <laughs> we love the excitement. So tell me about the educational path that maybe you took or that you would might recommend for students who are interested in nursing. Um, so in high school, I was very interested in sciences and maths and I was competitive, always striving to get those best grades and beat people. So I, I took the anatomy, physiology, chemistries, and that helped in college because then you, I was familiar with those terms and systems. And what does a typical day look like for you or what's a highlight of your day that you enjoy? Um, a typical day is just patience all day long and working with them one-on-one, -on -one, giving that education, helping them, being that support that they might need in that time. And what do you think is your number one piece of biggest advice for students who are watching this and think, hey, being an RN might be for me? Um, I would say reach out to somebody that you know um, in a field that you're interested in. See if you can shadow them. 
get with your guidance counselors, um, ask questions. What, what kind of classes should I take if I'm thinking about doing this? And then just be open-minded. When you're shadowing, um, shadow more than once. Look around the room that you're shadowing in. I, you might be following somebody being a nurse, but be observant to everything in the room because that might perk your interest as well. That's some great advice. If you're interested in a healthcare career, talk to your guidance counselor and see what advice they have. Feel free to shadow a hospital. Many hospitals, Great Plains Health included, love to have students in our facilities checking out the awesome careers that are in healthcare. So be sure to take advantage of those opportunities around you. Thank you, Jamie, so much for sharing more about your career and thank you for joining us.